Soaring overhead costs and a labor shortage are making it difficult for many restaurant owners to make ends meet. One longtime restaurant owner said he had to close three of his locations last year. Max Rodriguez has more. It's one of the most difficult decisions for restaurateurs, deciding to call it quits. The Ruby Tuesday Hawaii owner says he had to close three restaurants in the last year. He says it's difficult finding staff. We don't get much applications in. Um, we keep up and pay, and that isn't the factor. They just, the workforce isn't there. He says the rise in minimum wage is also chipping away at their revenue. The Hawaii Restaurant Association says at least five other restaurants have closed in the past month. Lease renewals are also playing a factor. Many times you will see when the lease comes up at the end of the 10-year term, the restaurant has to really, really do a lot of soul searching and say, you know, what is my next 10 years going to look like? You know, are the employees coming back? Are costs going to start dropping? Restaurants with a smaller footprint and fewer overhead costs may be faring better in this economy. The food trucks at Ohana Hale Marketplace in Waikiki going from three vendors to 16 in a short period of time. It's much cheaper and, um, than leasing a building, but one thing great about it is um, everybody in Hawaii wants to eat. Well, there's no denying the overhead cost is lower for these food truck owners compared to brick and mortar. Their monthly rent is less and they all split the cost of utilities amongst themselves. The general manager of Earth Aloha Eats says they operate a couple of food trucks and a walk-in restaurant on Maui. The restaurant needs three people minimum. Here we can operate with two and do just as much as the restaurant can. Still, there's an appetite for sit-down dining. Restaurants counting on Valentine's Day to help give them a boost. But even Nakashima admits his interest in exploring smaller concepts. The way to go now is smaller footprints that are more profitable, that have less labor. Max Rodriguez, KH1 News, working for Hawaii.